Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you watch regularly, you already know that I've already prepped, primed my face and applied foundation. If you want to see a foundation routine, check in the description box for a flawless foundation routine video. Now let's get this look started. The first thing I'm going to do is apply a primer to my lids, and I'm using Urban Decay's Primer Potion, the original one. This is going to ensure that my eyeshadow lasts all day long. The palette we'll be using for this look is the Naked 3 palette, and the first color we're using is Strange, which is a soft vanilla matte eyeshadow. I'm going to apply this all over my lids. Next, I'm going to use a felt tip eyeliner to create the base of my eyeliner. And instead of filling it all the way in like I usually do, I'm leaving it empty to create a small triangle. And this is going to create a different and unique wing. Are you brave enough to try it out? Next, I'm wetting the tip of my brush so that when I apply my eyeshadow, it comes out more metallic-y. And the eyeshadow that we'll be using is Trick. We're going to apply this right in the inside of our triangle. And again, it doesn't have to be perfect because we will be fixing it up later. Once our triangle is all filled in, I'm going to go back in with the color Nooner into my crease, blending it out. And it's okay if you blend out the edges of your eyeliner because we will be darkening them up again. To create this beautiful and sleek wing, I definitely recommend using Ink Lots number 77. It is now my ultimate favorite eyeliner. So now I'm going to go ahead and trace over the lines that I created originally, creating very nice, clean, thin, straight lines. Finish off your eyeliner by applying it to your lower lashes, starting on the outer corner until midway in. Since I will not be using flossies because I want to show off my unique eyeliner, I'm going to go ahead and curl my lashes and prepare them for mascara. Make sure to apply some coats to your top and bottom lashes. Now I'm going to be using Matt's Lovejoy blush, which has always been an all-time favorite and I've recently gotten back into it. And I'm just going to go ahead and apply that into the hollows of my cheek and blend it outwards onto the apples of my cheeks. For my lips, I'll be using one of my new favorite lip colors by Revlon, their Matte Balm in color 225 Sultry. Now, if you guys want to check out what are some of my other favorite spring lip products, definitely check out last week's video. I'll link it here, which is a whole lookbook music montage kind of quirky thing that I created for you guys to show off all the colors that I'm loving for this spring. And finally, be sure to fill in your brows, keep it simple and natural, and you're good to go. So, what did you guys think about this look? Would you rock this kind of eyeliner? Comment below, leave me your thoughts, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe, and until next time guys, I love you so much, remember that you're absolutely beautiful. Bye! Mwah.